All right, guys. I am thrilled to say it is a spectacularly gorgeous, over-the-top, beautiful spring day here in the end times in paradise on <coughs> Thursday morning, March 1st, 2018. Yeah, yeah, about March rolling in like a lion. If this is a lion, I can't imagine what a lamb looks like, so I'm going to get out there and enjoy this gorgeous day by declaring war on Bermuda grass. Don't get me going on that. But before I do, in uh, trying to work up the <coughs> energy for a depressed collapsitarian wine, I know I don't have the energy for a dump, for a dump the Trump the high roundup rant. Fuck that guy. But anyway, I do have time before I head out into this beautiful day to dive into my Humpty Dumpty Tribe mailbag to see what's on the minds of alert listeners here in the tribe. And I always enjoy listening to people's visions of, you know, just what it's going to look like as this whole thing flies apart. Uh, how people's vision of the Mad Max dystopian future. So we're going to start off with Yankee Sandy uh, from Environmental Coffee House. She asked the question, live life. If we are fucked, what can we do? Plant our gardens and act as if. Apparently, Sandy, you mean act as if we're not fucked. Uh, and that's about all we can do. It will be an act, I assure you. Whatever we do from here on out is acting as if we're not fucked. But anyway, so Brother Philip Stone. Philip, I don't know if I've ever had you as a comment of the day, maybe a New Tribes member. This is Philip responding to Sandy. What can we do? We, meaning the eco-Nazis down here in the Doomosphere on Humpty Dumpty Tribe, we are already way ahead of the pack. We are aware. <clears throat> Those who deny climate change or refuse to research and understand just how bad it is imminently about to become are going to blow a gasket. Their heads will explode and they will panic. Panic like they have never panicked before. They will burn down the cities, kill everything in sight, overrun government offices, be mowed down like animals by the military, run away, kill themselves, kill their kids, parentheses, are you ready to hear about parents killing their kids to save them from the chaos? That is a tough one to wrap your head around. Getting back to the list, destroy the power grid causing Fukushima's everywhere, blow up museums and libraries, turn to religion and find no answers there to keep them alive, eat their pets. Sancho Panza, are you ready to go into the stew pot here in the end times? I don't know, I gotta fatten up Sancho Panza before I eat him. Jump off tall buildings into heaps of rotting flesh. Drown themselves in alcohol and then who knows what. And the usual steal, rape, and murder at a scale never ever seen before. Remember the Watts riots? Imagine it nationwide, worldwide. We are better prepared 
and all, but the few thousand here in the Doomosphere imagine being, a few thousand here in the Doomosphere imagine being in such a select group. Yes. <clears throat> Is your mind ready to accept the news of the very worst that humans can do? Really ready? I will be gone to see. I can turn off the shortwave, I can hide, emerge somewhere and help pick up the pieces, start again. First rule of prepping, prepare your mind. Prepare your mind, and that's part of the, uh, the if I do work up the energy for my depressed collapse of Terry and wine, I might be picking up uh, as part of that wine on this line of thinking. You know, this news out of what's going on up there at the North Pole uh, this week, you know, even on my level of eco-Nazism, uh, I, I have to say this news coming from the North Pole this week, while I'm sitting here barefooted uh, on this gorgeous spring day, uh, you know, guys, it's, uh, the rubber has hit the road here on planet Earth in 2018, and it's going to be a wild fucking ride from here on out. But as long as YouTube will let me keep sitting here chronicling it before they shut my smart ass down, I'm going to be sitting right here bringing you more. And with that, the little dog's going to go get some squirrelies. And I'm going to go do some battle with some Bermuda grass here in the end times. Bye, guys.